友，大家晚安。这里是津津乐道，我是周乐。我们在 C H Premier 的店里面，今天拍摄的这一天，在这个店里有一个特别的 event。这个 event 呢，是来介绍各种从传统一直到现在最新的 Mr. Roberto Coin 的 design。多么兴奋的一天！现在站在我旁边的就是 Roberto Coin himself. He's the owner and he's the designer. Roberto, can I call you your first name? Of course. So exciting to see you. you <laughs> okay. Uh, we normally normally I interview the president or the vice president or the marketing director of the company at CH. But today I have the pleasure to interview the designer, the owner. You know, I'm so passionate about this creativity of the design. Your company was formed in 1977 Correct. and it's branding in 1996. Correct. Tell us about your background first. Well, very unusual background. Uh, I lost my parents when I was very young and I was a boarding school in Switzerland. Ah. I was fascinated about the hotel industry. Hotel industry? industry. You and yeah. um, I became a young hotelier ah. uh, and then I went to England to learn English and I opened a cafe, mm. I opened a restaurant mm -hmm. and then I opened a luxury hotel. Ah. And at 33, I sold it because I was in love with fashion. With fashion? Yes. You mean dress design? Yes. Okay. Fashion overall. That's fine. You and were only 32. 33. 33? Yes. And at 33, I went back to Italy and I started the jewelry industry as a hobby. Uh huh. And it's, today is a big hobby. Yeah. <laughs> today is the majority of your life. Correct. Okay. So you think you're talent of design jewelry it's from the Italian blood because Italian men or women are famous for your creativities of designing the airplane the yacht the automobile and all kinds of things and then you have been in hotel in the fashion industry all of a sudden you became a jewelry designer where did you get your inspiration from well I think it's part of our culture yeah uh, Italy has a a beautiful history, mm -hmm. 2,000 years of history. Yes. Probably even more. When we look at this design, yeah. it becomes, is the design from the Tuscan yeah. time. Uh -huh. People which lived in Tuscany, and they were the first, first civilization of Italy. Mm. So you are inspired by the beauty of art, mm -hmm. the beauty of everything which has been done before. Mm -hmm. And then, of course, uh, I've been traveling 117 countries. 117 countries yes. in the entire world. The entire world. Different people. Yeah. Lovely people. Including this, China. Including <laughs> China. And in China, I've been, I think, over 30 times. Uh huh. In Beijing, Shanghai, uh -huh. Macau. Yes. Uh, Hong Kong, which yeah. is part of Greater China. Yes. Taiwan. Yeah. And uh, I'm fascinated by about people. Mm. I'm fascinated about history. Mm -hmm. I'm fascinated about culture. Mm -hmm. And uh, I love all that. Mm -hmm. So it's from your life experience. Correct. So your design has been from the beginning and the gradually changed into the modern design to fit the trendy people. And you certainly have a lot of collectible items. And I have seen your design has been changing and we're going to talk about it later on. There are many jewelry design in this industry. How are you different from them? Well, much different. Uh, much different because I come from different culture. Yes. Different schooling. Yeah. Um, I cannot design. I can do drawing. Mm -hmm. But today is not a question of design, it's a question of creativity. Mm. If you have a creativity mind, you're able to create a new jewelry, new idea, new concept every time. Mm. And this to me is essential. Then from my sketch, I give it to my designer. Okay. And then my designer works with my model makers. Mm -hmm. And they are the maestros, which they are capable of doing everything I give to them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And of course, I become very knowledgeable 
and they know how every piece is made. Mm -hmm. Not only from our company, mm -hmm. but even from our competitor. Mm -hmm. There's no one piece of jewelry you show me that I do not know how it's made. Mm -hmm. So you become an expert. Mm -hmm. And I want to be different. I always mm -hmm. wanted to be Roberto. Mm -hmm. I never copied anybody. Mm -hmm. You I, want to be different. I like to be influenced by people, mm -hmm. by cultures, mm -hmm. by everything. But always with Roberto Coin mm -hmm. style. Okay. We are in the heart of Silicon Valley. The innovation of technology and that there are two kinds of people who can be very successful street smart and the book smart yes so in the world of design is that also the same very Do, much so very much very so. so it seems we to me like you are a street smarter everything comes from your life experience it comes from our life experience but i i never uh, give up to innovation mm. so there is a lot of new product which is you can only create by innovation mm. with new machinery mm. and you combine uh, innovations with the ancient art mm -hmm. and the two the combination, the combination of the ancient the art and the innovation wonderful pieces oh. so i managed to combine that okay so not everything is totally totally unmade yeah this is totally unmade I know this is a bingo I wish I yes. had that on my wrist today this is totally unmade ah. <clears throat> it's a ram it's uh, a ram yeah yeah and uh, I have a collections of about 180 mm. oh. different ah. type of animal yeah. yes innovation it, yes. plus the craft the unique craftsmanship correct yeah. this is totally totally done by hand oh totally. it's a handmade yes mm. And in your career life, you said you have designed 51,000 pieces. And by looking at the CH window, it's from this part to that part. It's like a miniature of the Great Wall in China. <laughs> yes. And as I was talking to you, and it seems like you seems they have enough, but in your own world, you have even a lot more. You have more than 3,000 designs. Correct which we actually still manufacture today. We have over 3,000 designs. Mm. And the reason is uh, I follow fashion. Mm. Uh, fashion is continuously changing. Yes. Uh, way of thinking is changing. Mm -hmm. Way of perceiving, you know, jewelry is changing. Mm -hmm. So I'm always up to date with the color of the year, yeah. the fashion of the year, yeah. their style of the year. Yeah. And, uh, as you know very much, so you when are you the, are going shopping... You are not only follow the color, the style, I think you are the trendsetter. Well, very much so, yes. yes. Very much trendsetter yeah. today. We are probably the most copy designer yeah. worldwide. Yeah. Because uh, I, I tr I'm curious. Mm -hmm. And you have to be a very curious person... I understand. ...to be able to be up to date right. with the fashion world of today. Yeah. Today is uh, the interview with Mr. Roberto Coin in CH. Today, we will talk about individual pieces. 休息一下，马上就回来。